when Russia launched its special military operations in Ukraine on February 24, it didn't take long for the international community to condemn the attack and react accordingly. Thereafter, Western powers imposed strict sanctions on Russia, hoping to crash the country's ailing economy and force President Vladimir Putin to retreat. But more than four months and tens of thousands of casualties later, hopes of a quick resolution of the conflict have vanished, as a lengthy war of attrition looks increasingly likely. Statistas Felix Richter, in his article, said that while the sanctions against Russia have thus far failed to deplete Putin's war chest, their impact is being felt all over the world. The survey finds that 58 to 59 percent of EU citizens aren't ready to accept rising energy and food prices as a consequence of sanctions against Russia. It needs to be noted, however, that the results vary heavily across countries and socioeconomic groups. While respondents in high-income countries such as Denmark, Sweden and the Netherlands overwhelmingly support action against Russia, Regardless of rising prices, respondents from lower-income EU member states such as Greece and Bulgaria are less willing to pay a personal price. Across the EU, those respondents who often or at times encounter difficulties paying bills are less likely to say they are ready to face food and energy price increases.